Welcome back to City Lights on Novus TV. I'm your host, Zara Girani. We're here at the Center of Performing Arts for the 25th annual celebration of Crazy Aids. We'll be speaking with the filmmakers as well as executive director, Grace Chin. For those individuals who do not know what Crazy Eights is and how crazy it gets, tell us about Crazy Eights. Crazy Eights is a filmmaking program run by the nonprofit Crazy Eights Film Society that's been running since 1999. It was founded by members of the uh, Directors Guild of Canada, BC, and it is a program that helps emerging and transitioning filmmakers make a professional quality short film, especially if they don't have that much funding or resources to make it. They do make it in eight days. Astronaut Hari. He has to go back to Earth to complete his mission. But is it his job on the moon? Yeah. I was inspired by the idea of the the, the term astronaut family, which, which is uh, a common practice in the 1990s and 80s, that the family would send their kids and wives to a new country like Canada, and but the father keeps working in Asia to provide a better life. I hope that I can spread the message of courage. We are not that alone in the world. We all share the same experience and just want to tell the young Kevin that it's everywhere and you should not be feel alone. Wow, look at you. Uncle Dave, I hate it. I look like a fat Barbie. You're perfect. Plus, your mom worked so hard on that new dress. Why do I even have to wear this stupid crappy dress? Language, Chelsea. So my film is Topic, okay. and it follows a teenage figure skater pushing back against the conservative constraints of her sport in the 1990s. The inspiration for the film was my own experience. So was that a topic that was given to you guys to draw from? No, I think the 90s were just really fun and we all want to go back there. They made more sense in some ways. You don't even want to bother with the Lutz at all. Chelsea, what has gotten into you lately? All my other girls landed their Lutzes last year. Jill just landed her double. Jess, congratulations. I just want to say you look absolutely spectacular. You got the note to dress up in Vancouver where no one dresses up. We go all out. We have to slay. If we're not slaying, then what are we doing? Just being here at Crazy Eights and having the opportunity as a non-binary first-time director is really exciting and I feel very honored. The movie is a queer story about a young writer who is on a bit of a grinder bender and then he uh, ends up on a date with his old high school professor. Ooh, there's some, it's tea, it's drama, and it's also really sweet. I think the movie is like ultimately very wholesome. But each night when he walks his dog, he dreams about another life entirely. Is this about you? I didn't know it was about me when I wrote it, but you know, sometimes you know before you know, you know? Read for me. No, no, no. I beg, I beg, I want to learn about Ralph. <laughs> Tell me more. Oh my God. What an inspiring evening. I'm certainly feeling empowered to start writing and work on my first short film. Well, until next time, I'm your host, Zara Durrani, and I'll catch you on City Lights on Novus TV.